hello everybody and welcome back to make it monday in today's video i will be making a sweatshirt and i already did the pattern that i'm using is this pattern and it comes with two options for the sweater and i already did the other option i will put it in the description below to that video today i have cut out my two sleeves and this is bullet fabric and i will put it in the description of where i got this fabric from I have my two sleeves cut out. I have my back piece cut out. I have my front piece cut out. I have my waistband cut out. I have my cuffs cut out and I also have my neckband cut out. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to take the front piece and the back piece and I'm going to put it right sides together and with this pattern it comes with these marks so you can know to snip it so you can find the center pieces so I'm gonna take my two pieces my front and my back I'm gonna line them up right sides together and with this I'm gonna be using my serger you can use your sewing machine and with your sewing machine you just want to use a zigzag stitch so the first thing I'm going to do is serge the two shoulder seams together and then I'll be back. So after you have your shoulder seams serge, I'm then going to take it and open it with right sides facing up and I'm going to take my sleeve. And then with my sleeve, you will have a notch right here where you snip that. And then I'm going to place that notch with the seam that I just sewn for the arm. So I'm just going to place it on top of it. And then I'm going to pin it. And then I'm going to line this end of the sleeve with the end of the armhole like this and then I'm going to pin it and if you want you can put a pin in between these two pins and then I'm going to pin the other side the same exact way I'm then going to take it over to my serger machine and I'm going to serge from this end to this end. And I'm going to do that with both of the sleeves and I'll be back. So after I sewn on the sleeve, this is how it would look. So I have my sleeve, my front piece, my sleeve, my back piece. Next, I'm going to take it and match the sleeves up right sides together. And then I'm going to put a pin. And then I'm going to match the armholes up. The armhole seam seams. And I'm going to put a pin. And then I'm going to match the sweatshirt bottom pieces together and I'm going to put a pin. So as I have a pin at the beginning of the sleeve, I have a pin at the armhole, and I have a pin at the bottom of the sweater. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to serge this line on this side, and then I'm going to do the same on the other side, and I'll be So back. after I serge this side, I also serge this side. So the sweater is pretty much done. The next thing I'm going to do is take my cuff piece, and fold them right sides together and then I'm going to serge and then with my waistband I'm going to fold that right sides together and I'm going to serge and with my neck band also I'm going to fold that right sides together and I'm going to serge so I'll be back 
So after I have my cuff pieces and my waistband and my neck piece, I'm going to take my waistband and I'm going to snip it on the folded line on the opposite side that I sewn so I can know what, um, what part is the center. And I'm also gonna do that with the neck band. So next I'm going to, so next I'm going to take the sweater and I'm gonna take the cuffs and fold them with the right sides facing out. Well, I'm going to fold it in half. lining the seams up I'm then going to place my cuff inside of the sleeve with this seam matching this um, side seam and then I'm going to pin it around and then I'm gonna go over to the serger and I'm gonna serge around I'm gonna do that with both sides and I'll be back after I finish serging my sleeves on, I'm going to take my neck band and I'm going to fold that in half with the right side spacing out. And then I'm gonna pin the seam up with the back of it. And I'm going to pin it Then I'm going to take the front piece that I snipped and I'm going to line that up with the front snip of the sweater and I'm going to pin it. Next, I'm going to line up the sides together and I'm going to pin that And then I'm going to go over to my serger and serge on the neck piece. I'm just gonna serge in a circle and then I'll be back. So after I have my neck band sewn on, I'm gonna move down to the waistband. So I'm gonna take the two side seams and I'm gonna match them together, right sides together. And I'm going to snip the center back and I'm going to snip the center front. So that way it's even when I go ahead and put my waistband on. It makes it easier. So this side is the back and this side is the front. So then with my waistband, I went ahead and did the same thing. After I sewn it together, I went ahead and snipped these two corners and then I matched the corners I just snipped with the seam. And then I went ahead and snipped these two corners. So now I'm going to take it and fold it right sides facing out. And I'm going to line it up with the seams I snipped on the sweater all the way around. I'm going to pin them and then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to serge in a circle and I'll be back. So I finished with the bottom piece and the sweatshirt is all done. So I'm going to take it and fold it right sides out. Before I, I do that, I'm going to cut all the loose fab, um, cut all the loose fabric off. But this is what it looked like when you're all done. This is the front of it. And this is the back of it.
Thank you all again for watching this video. Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And leave a comment of what you want to see me make. I will put in the description of where I got the fabric from. That is in the description of where I got the pattern from. And thank you all again for watching. Have a good day. Bye.